Hey guys, I just want to take a quick video of this uh, GPS tracking unit that I have installed in the T-Rex, but I'm also putting one in the Rango as well. It's been great. It's been about a year since I've been using it now. Uh, I picked it off Amazon uh, in Canada, so, uh, 30 bucks for it, and it does require a uh, subscription to use it. It's 30 bucks a month or so for that. Um, however, you could have up to uh, you could have up to 99 of these trackers for that subscription for that rate. So I think it's a it's a, been a great unit for me. Mine's hardwired and mine's hidden in the truck. But I'm just gonna show you everything that this kit contains here because I really really like it. It's just some added security again. We know that the Sears Guardian um, it is one of those first things that are disabled when your truck is stolen as well. Um, so this is why I went to this route of really burying this unit inside my truck here as well. So for the tracker itself, this is the actual unit here as well. Um, it's a cute little size there. Very small, very discreet as well. It does come with a few different panels and plates here. Um, there is an internal battery for this. It can take, I think you can do it up for, it depends on how often you want the signal refreshed in order for that battery to last. However, I also have a hard wire kit for it, but if you just want to charge it, maybe toss it somewhere in the truck. It's also a magnet as well here, as we can see that there. And we also have a little case here as well. And uh, so once again, depending where you're putting this unit, all these accessories can be very helpful. And this is 30 bucks Canadian for the unit here. Also comes with some uh, two-way tape, with some Velcro strips there. Little strap here as well. We'll just kind of open this up here. So a lot of accessories for what you're getting here. The biggest thing with these units is, is really just your subscription, your monthly subscription, right? Uh, what you're going to be paying for. However, because I'm using it for a year, it's been incredibly accurate as well. You can set up geofencing. Um, you can track the speed of the vehicle, set up alarms, stuff like that. So there's a lot of different features. Now, I'm not endorsed. I don't even make any money to YouTube or anything like that. Um, it's just something I want to share with you guys to help with the reduction of the theft for our vehicles. This is a hardwire kit. It's a pretty basic kit here. Uh, so you got your USB uh, USB connector here that goes into the actual tracking unit itself here. And this piece could go to a battery or another 12 volt um, system in the truck there or your vehicle, wherever you want to put it. And it's fused as well there. Is there any relevance for me opening this fuse? Because as I bitch out and can't do it, my bitch hands. Anyways, it's just a great unit. I just want to talk a little bit about it, kind of show you what the overview is and all the little items and, and knickknacks that you're getting with this. There's another cover as well here with kind of a belt kind of clip or uh, I'll call it a belt clip or whatever. But yeah, it's been a great unit. The app is really easy to use as well here. And um, for the 30 bucks a month, I'm pretty happy with, uh, with the service that I've been receiving using this. Uh, I use it on Android and that's where I control it. There's also one for that, uh, what's that? Uh, the queer one, the Apple one. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, so I mean, if um, it, it works really great there. All right, nothing, not nothing against gays. Just, yeah, I should probably edit that out. Anyways, it's a great unit here. And while we're here, let's just talk about this other my dash cam. So I have this dash cam as well um, in the T Rex, um, but I really enjoy it as well. This Van True three channel camera. Three channels means you get three cameras essentially. So this one does a front camera, a rear camera, and because I'm colored, we got to have the interior camera, you know, just in case. Anyways, we, we don't get roughed up in Canada as much as I see in the States. This has nothing to do with uh, BLM or anything like that. Anyway, so I'll probably edit that out too. So what do we have in here? We got, oh yeah, because I'm really going to put that shit on my car. I guess we got some stickers, instruction manual. Let's take this little box here. Dump it out here. All kinds of goodies that are here as well. Get this shit out. I might be organized here. Okay, so this camera includes a few things as well here. I'm gonna open up. Let's have a gander here. We have a really nice long, I believe this is gonna be just a cable. Yeah, so it does come standard with just uh, your 12 volt plug in there. Um, I prefer to hardwire it uh, just because it's cleaner. And uh, I believe that actually will enable your parking mode features and things of that nature. And then we have the actual camera unit itself here, which is a nice size unit. 
it's not too big, it's not too bulky. This unit has a, the screen on there as well, so when it's in your vehicle, it's basically shooting, um, I believe it's, I believe it's, it's shooting, yeah, so your primary camera here shoots 4K, your rear camera shoots uh, 2.7, and your interior, I believe, is around 1080, but you can configure all those settings within the camera as well. So it's just a nice size unit for this Van True camera. Hell. Have here, oh, yes, um, little it actually comes with an interior pry tool as well for helping just to root your wires for the installation. Uh, this inside this lock mechanism here as well is also the GPS unit, so you can track where your vehicle uh, has been going. If you want to pull the memory card as well, it'll pull your speed data where it was geographically as well. If there is an incident you need to reference, put that there. And in our last one here, this one is uh, sorry, it's actually part of the power cable as well so this is going to be you know if you're running your your rear camera as well cable that comes with this so you do get a lot of girth a lot of cable girth there for you and this one actually is the rear camera there as well and as i said this is about a year and a half since i'm running it so i picked one up for the other car there and uh this one great so this you know plugs into here and that goes into here to your 12 volt source there and we also have the hardwire kit Which is here as well, and we're going to do a video at some point of running the hardware kit. Uh, just because in the Durango, much like the 1500 Rams, there's only one fuse panel on the 4th gen and the classics, and that's underneath the hood. So same for the Durango as well there. So we have our uh, USB-C as to what um, the camera uses here for plugging in there. And this can go to a 12-volt source. Uh, in my case, for the Durango, I'll just run it under the hood to the fuse panel, more than likely. Or I'll take apart some wires and some trim, and we'll see where we get a 12-volt signal there. But it also does include some fuses, And these are great, too, because, once again, they're fuses, so you're not losing anything. For God's sakes, I hate this. Get it open there. Okay. A little shit show we got going here. Anyways. But, yeah, it does include... An array of fuses and everything there as well. For depending on your style for your vehicle, it's going to be one of these. There's no doubt about that because there is no other designs, I believe, for it. But anyways, so I just want to kind of point out some of these, some of these items that I use in my vehicles day to day. Once again, the Van True three channel, the Tracky GPS unit here. Um, they've just been items that I found that have been great for my vehicle, and I want to share that with you guys. And also shout out to Murphy's Law. Great moonshine and liquor. It's uh, they're they're a local company to me to where I am in uh, in the KW region over here in Ontario, Canada, and uh, they're fantastic alcohol. So shout out to Murphy's Law there. Thank you very much for my apple pie and cherry bomb. That's fantabulous. All right, guys. Well, thanks for checking out the video there. Appreciate it. If you have any questions, comments? Drop me a question. Drop me a question. Drop me a comment. Whatever you got to do, just just do it. All right. Thanks, guys. Peace. As per usual, I normally forget something. Uh, so sorry, this is also the memory card. Something to keep in mind with uh, this dash cam, it's a proprietary memory card here. Uh, so that means that the Vantru brand card is the only one that can function with it. Uh, much like if you're using... Shit. Sorry, so if you're also running like a Thinkware dash cam, Thinkware also does the uh, proprietary cards as well there for it. Do I have a Thinkware one here? No, I don't. But I also used to think we're one of my other vehicles. Anyways, so yeah, this is uh, the proprietary card that you're using. Son of a bitch. Thanks, guys.